What time is it? It's Mickey's very merry Christmas party time. Okay, we've got our guide map. Let's go have a holiday adventure. Okay, we got our <clears throat> Sorcerers of the Magic Kingdom event card. And it is the birds from the Tiki Room. The Tiki Room's for calling birds. It's only a five minute wait for Little Mermaid. So let's go visit Ariel. Okay, despite all the treats that they're handing out at this event, I did buy one. I got the Vanellope Eclair just because it looked really cute. I, I can't remember the last time I had an Eclair, but it has um, pretty pebbles all over it. <laughs> so I don't know if I'm going to like it, but let's find out. I'm trying to do both of these at the same time. This looks really sticky. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, it's better than I thought. It's extremely sweet. Of course it is. If you like fruity pebbles, you'll like it. <laughs> it's like a fruity, it's a fruity pebble dessert, basically. I need some water. <laughs> Disney couples are out for the holidays. So I'm walking through Fantasyland and over here a guy's safe. Mm. This place always smells great. Not like Six Flags. Six Flags always smells. And I couldn't quite hear what he said after that, but it sounded like he said cow. <laughs> I don't know. 15 minute wait for who?
Okay, so I wonder if they're actually giving out goodies or not because I've been burned before at the Chris at the Christmas at the Halloween party where they had the little blow up out. Then they got up there and they weren't they weren't giving it out. <laughs> Just got a bunch of cookies. I'm not gonna be eating all these. Sebastian, you're getting some treats.
shop souvenirs. This is my favorite shop in the Magic Kingdom. And I think it's, I just seem to always find a cute shirt or stuffed animal or a yummy treat in here. I just always seem to find something that I love. I have good luck with the store, I guess, is what I'm saying. Like, this is the first time I've seen these guys in plush, and it's here. Like, um, they had Dumbo and his mom, Jumbo, Jumbo Jr. and his mother, that plush, which I don't know if they still sell that, but I found it here first before I saw it anywhere else. So, I don't know. This shop seems to have good plushies and good everything. I really like that these... Um, the Snow White focus and the Cinderella are side glancing and they're joining too. I like that. They are $24.99. Very pretty. I think Snow White and Cinderella I like the most and I also really like um, Tiana. She's kind of side glancing too. All of them kind of are. Some are more dramatic than others. Just doesn't want to focus it's because it's reflecting too much but these are really pretty I used to collect fashion dolls I have a lot of them and I've been trying to stop but I still like to look action figures too toys in general <clears throat> so I'm trying to be a good girl so I just look and comment on them now it's a little easier now that Toys R Us isn't around weep what every child wants to come home with the parking lot tram toy Actually, I think this is really cute, but I can't imagine a kid wanting this. Not really. Uh, $19.99. It's, for a lot of kids, it's the first ride to go on. This shop also smells really good because of all the treats. Well, I kind of passed them all, but they, they're all kind of sold in the center. The fresh made stuff and like the bakery stuff. <clears throat> so it smells like cotton candy in here. So not only do you get to look at toys and clothes, Look at the pleasant scent of cotton candy. Oh wait, here's some more. All of that deliciousness. These apples look really good. There's Dumbo and his mama. It's such a cute little set. Uh, $29.99. Really soft too. I managed to walk out of there without buying anything. It's a Christmas miracle. McDuck and Donald. It's a really long line to visit these guys. So, I'm gonna have to pass. I don't have the kind of time tonight. Donald looks like he's ready to go cut down a Christmas tree. Yeah. And Scrooge looks like he's ready to make more money. <laughs> and there's Santa Goofy.
we could do that. makes the holidays so special. red in there. I think it's a vanilla cupcake though. But yeah, this is from the, the Main Street Bakery or the Starbucks as I call it. It looks like a lot of fun. I think this is um, Rice Krispie Treat. It's just like dipped in a colored white chocolate. How much was this? I don't even pay attention how much I spend. Uh, it was $6.99. It's pretty big. Here's my hand. So it is just past midnight, so I teleported back to my hotel room. I'm gonna try this uh, Wreck-It Ralph cupcake. See if I can do this with just one hand, with one hand on the camera and one hand. I just wanna know what flavor the inside of this is. I know that the, um, okay, I'm just, okay, oh, it's red, it is red. It's red cake. Oh my God. This is entirely peppermint, you guys. They call it Sugar Rush Cupcake, but they don't mention it's peppermint. But... Ah! <laughs> it is. That's a really, like, deep... It lo probably looks brown to you guys. I don't know, but this is red. Which makes sense if you're peppermint, right? Yeah. I did take a nibble out of this because it was already falling off. And it was peppermint, and it is Rice crispy. And I'm assuming the Ralph's head's just like a white chocolate. This is all peppermint. <laughs> I've never had a peppermint cupcake before. It is, the, the frosting is really good, like the texture of it, but it's very, very pepperminty. It's funny eating a cupcake and having your breath, like your mouth feel all, all, all refreshed. <laughs> Okay, anyway, one last thing. I got uh, the um, pass holder pin. Isn't it cute? It's all sparkly and it's got Donald all angry. Uh, I hope you liked the video. There was a lot more going on at that um, show than what I could possibly show you guys. Um, this is $14.99, by the way. Um, multiple shows, a stage shows, dance parties, the fireworks, treat stations. It's a lot of fun. If you have a chance to go, I recommend it. Thanks for watching.